And then it comes down to education and building awareness because most small business owners don't even know that there's an opportunity to sell, uh, nor do they necessarily want to sell. But a little bit like traditional real estate, like buying an apartment in Sydney, if someone knows that one, their apartment is worth 20% more than when they paid for it, then they become more motivated. And two, if they realize that they can now do something with that monies, they become even more motivated. And in an online business ownership context, you want to ensure that online business owners understand how much their value, how much their business is actually worth. So we focus a lot of our attention on helping business owners understand that. So what is my business worth? What is the valuation of my asset? Um, and the other part is education, because if something's only one year old or two years old, then it's about us talking to that customer now um, while fully appreciating that that customer might not be ready to sell today. If we can educate them as to how to scale their business to the point at which they can get the best possible price, um, then they might be ready for Flipper in two to three years time. But, you know, we're talking about a, a universe of five to 600 million digital assets around the world. So, and more digital assets coming into the ecosystem every year. So there's certainly no shortage of assets and much like traditional real estate, you know, we're talking big, big dollars here. So, you know, the average business might be worth $50,000. Um, you don't need to sell too many businesses to have a, a big marketplace.